a senior advisor to the UK Labour Party, who serves under Foreign Minister David Lammy, recently came under fire for comments questioning the significance of Prince William's future legacy. Ben Judah, a close associate and strategic figure for Lammy, has faced backlash for alleged anti-British sentiments following remarks some see as critical of the monarchy and sympathetic to Republican ideas. Royal supporters argue that Judah's statements downplay the importance of the Commonwealth, a historic organization that Queen Elizabeth cherished and which King Charles and the British government continue to support. At a recent summit in Samoa, the King and the Prime Minister emphasized the value of the Commonwealth ties. However, Judah previously commented that the Commonwealth's influence was more an illusion upheld by Queen Elizabeth's presence than a reality. Judah also stirred controversy by suggesting that Prince William might not command the same respect and public mourning as Queen Elizabeth did. Reflecting on the Queen's passing in 2022, he questioned whether William would elicit the same deep public affection, describing him simply as a resident of West London in an era where the once sacred aura of royalty has significantly diminished. The criticism extended to Foreign Minister David Lammy, as some interpreted Judah's opinions as indicative of Lammy's own stance. Former Conservative leader Sir Ian Duncan Smith responded, attributing Judah's views to a dismissive attitude common among left-leaning Labour members, whom he accused of disregarding the nation's history and heritage. In an attempt to contain the backlash, foreign office officials cited past articles in which Judah expressed respect for King Charles, predicting he would be a capable monarch. Minister Lammy himself has also recently praised King Charles, sharing a personal anecdote on social media about his mother's admiration for the royal family and her view of the Queen's life as an embodiment of unity for Britain.